welcome to Carmen's Australian Storytime. Today we are visiting Miller Miller Falls in the Atherton Tablelands. Look at those falls, aren't they beautiful? So I thought what a great place to read Paddles the Platypus. Paddles the Platypus is written and illustrated by Eva Marie Welsh and she is a local from Cairns area and she has written and illustrated uh, there is no blurb on this book either, so let's see what Paddles the platypus is up to. I wonder if there's a platypus living in this water. The creek was an exciting place where different kinds of animals meet. One afternoon, Cassie the cassowary, Chick and her dad saw something unusual in the water. What they could see looked like a duck's bill. What is that, Daddy? asked Casey. Cassie. Could it be a duck? Hmm. It doesn't really look like a duck. Further down the creek, Bobby the tree kangaroo was resting on a branch. A splosh in the water caught his attention. All he could see was a strong, furry tail. Tree kangaroos don't usually swim. It must be something else, Bobby muttered. Downstream, Crokey the tree frog was swimming in the creek. He wanted to join Gilbert, who was sitting on a rock. Both had had a busy day catching flies. A ripple in the water took him by surprise. It all happened so quickly. The back of a furry animal had appeared. Wait, a furry animal? Could it have been a crocodile? No, crocodiles don't have fur. <laughs> Squawk! Some cockatoos were splashing about at the creek. To their surprise, an unusual animal climbed onto the bank. Squawk! It had a bill and webbed feet like a duck a furry tail like a tree kangaroo, and a broad body like a crocodile. Sorry to disturb you. I am looking for a place to dig a burrow to lay my eggs, said Paddles the platypus. I didn't know mammals laid eggs, squawked Oscar the cockatoo. Paddles was hungry and searched for worms and shrimp with her rubbery bill, while a curious eel was watching. She needed energy to dig the burrow and lay her small eggs. Gurgle, gurgle. Bloop, bloop. When they hatched inside the burrow, the babies drink their mother's milk. Squirm, squelch, gurgle worms. After a while, Paddle's babies grew up. Paddles watched them proudly while they swam in the creek for their first time. Soon they would grow up to raise families of their own. And that's the end of the story. So Paddles was looking for a place to lay her eggs. The platypus is very unique to Australia. You can only see them and find them here in Australia. And yes, like that book says, they're mammals that lay eggs. All right, come on, Sam. Don't do forget to thing. slap the like button and subscribe.